Good morning, it's Mask Monday. I am I Martinez, my name is It's Sal, and we're going to do this mask and just talk about some products or brands that I would like to try, you know, if um, money wasn't an object, you know, if, you know, we had infinite money, you know, because, you know, Sometimes you just can't try things that you like. It's not in your budget. So one day. Yes, one day. So let's get into the mask. And then I'll show you. I have pictures on my iPad. And I was just going to bring them up. Because that's what's easiest for me. So I hope you are having a fabulous day. Monday. Fifteen minutes because I couldn't remember. All right, so can you guess? Like we're gonna start with palette. Sorry, it's like my hands were bothering me. We're gonna start with palettes. So can you guess? Like colors or brand? No. Okay. It's like, can you see it? I'm blinding you. No, you can't see it. There, you can see it. I know, oops. I don't know. There we go. It's from Colourpop. And it's like, um, the Sweet Top one, the Peachy Tones. Sorry. I was hoping I could get it just right, but there. That's better. Wait, I like Coral and Peachy Tones, and I, um... I just now got my first little ColourPop palette so I can try out the formula and I know like it's not a guarantee this is how it's going to be because mm, even though it's the same company sometimes the formulas aren't the same for every palette. So now next is going to be a Nomad palette. It was hard to pick because Nomad has like the more gorgeous colors like they all look so pretty but yes you can see it this one is just so gorgeous the one inspired by Romeo and Juliet like it's so pretty um like the darker side scares me a little bit but it's like you can make so many like pretty looks either keeping the sides like separated or just combining them and seeing what that leads to it's just fun you're just playing and it can always be washed away it's not like you're stuck with a crazy look forever so it's the fun thing about makeup you know don't get mad at me because i know some people have their feelings about Jeffree Star but like I don't know like he didn't do anything to me like whether he shows hateful stuff does hateful stuff like you know I don't know he didn't kiss my puppy or anything <laughs> so this one the pink religion let me see so you probably know what all these look like by now but this one and the pricked one are so freaking pretty and i don't have a glam light palette so this glam light makes the prettiest like 
I love their packaging for all of their palettes. They just look gorgeous. So this one was a hard decision too. I think this is mainly because of colors. I love purple. And I haven't worn purple eyeshadow in a long time. So I thought it was a really great choice. And this one, I haven't tried anything from Too Faced. It's the um, Born This Way Sunset Strip. I think it's stripped, not striped. It's stripped. <laughs> the colors look very pretty. And sorry, like, I'm not just inserting them. It would be much easier to see. Now, these ones, it's going to be skincare. And, like, I just pulled up pictures just in case you haven't seen packaging, but you probably heard of all of these brands because I've heard of them through, like, either other YouTubers or, like, subscription boxes. I just haven't tried any. It's not in my budget, but the Glow Recipe, I hear they are that their skincare is pretty affordable, uh, you know, for the most part, but I just, because I can't, I have to, like, you know, get a subscription where they have, like, sales, and that would be my way <laughs> to get some Kate Somerville. I, I just hear so many great things about her different lines so I was very interested this is the hydrocate one because my skin is dry and I need hydration lots and lots of hydration I've been seeing this one it's like can you see it it's a drunk elephant I've been seeing this one pop up a lot recently on Ipsy so I um, definitely would love to try it one day. Who knows what the future holds? This one I hear pretty good things. It's Tula. And that's not coming in just right. So, definitely want to try Tula and see that the last one. I love my face. I'm like all in my face. Definitely want to try LMS. Everyone seems to really love LMS products, so I'm like, yes, I would love to try it in one day. I haven't tried that one. Now, I just finished um, moisturizer from Wishful, and I really like that one a lot. I know some people are like, against it because it smells like lavender but that doesn't bother me because like I love the scent of lavender and also my sense of smell is not that strong so scents don't affect me as much as other people and if it bothers me that means that the scent is really really strong <laughs> I hope you have a wonderful Monday and comment some brands or some eyeshadow palettes or different things, you know, beauty wise that you would love to try, you know, if it was in your budget, let me know. I'm sure you have some as well. Like, it's like a little wish list of things you wish you could have and try. So, bye, have a fabulous Monday, wonderful week, and if not, I hope something fabulous, something great happens throughout your week, you know, so we can just like, you know, look on the bright side. Bye!